so sorry about that. I've had just the most crazy couple of weeks, six weeks, eight weeks. I don't know, I've had deadlines, moving house, my friend's wedding. Just so, so busy. And yeah, I haven't had time to do anything crafty at all, really, let alone make any YouTube videos. So sorry about that. Um, also, as you see, I am sat on the floor and I'll show you why. Can you see that? That would be a sleeping cat on my chair. I'm one of those crazy cat people that if he's asleep there, I'm not going to move him because he's my baby. So anyway, yeah, I went to the UKPA big meet. Oh, it was insane. Um, I don't really know what to say about it because if I start talking, I should have planned something to say really. Um, so it was the UK Panoradics big meet, which was held in Birmingham. Um, I went up there, had to stay over because it was a bit of a long trip. Uh, stayed with two amazing ladies, Tess, who I can't link, she don't think she has YouTube, and the lovely Paula from what has just been changed to Le Petite Paula, but is probably more well known as Pow and Ari Designs. Um, so yeah, those two were amazing. Poor Paula, sorry, is one of the most delightful people in the entire world. Um, we went shopping on Friday and then Saturday was the big meet itself, which was just, oh my goodness, I don't know where to start. It was insane, but amazing. Um, the admin team and other organisers just did the most incredible job. I don't know how they pulled it all together because it was just perfect and I, just brilliant. Um, so a big thank you to all of those amazing ladies who did that and organised everything and just wow and especially to Steph who kept complimenting my outfit on Saturday night and making me blush. <laughs> um, I didn't really get much footage, I kind of planned to um, but really really didn't just get around to it so I need the very few like 30 seconds of video and a couple of pictures I will throw in now. footage there um and also meeting some people like the wonderful zoe um of uk planner love who i've been writing to for a while now and she's just wonderful awesome i love meeting her and her friend nicola who i hadn't spoken to before but obviously hung out with at the meet is brilliant um i'm very very lucky she got a free erin condren lucky cow <laughs> um, well deserved obviously uh, Michelle of Ugly Bug, amazing meeting with her, I was really looking forward to it. She must have footage somewhere of me looking really gormless as I walked in going, oh, and then I could see her waving. I was like, oh, hey. So she's got footage of me probably somewhere looking horrific. Um, I don't, if I start naming people, then I'm going to like leave someone out just and I'm not that well known in the group, so I'm not particularly active on the Facebook groups. So I don't know why I'm just not, but um, so not many people would have known me, but um, it was still just incredible, amazing. I don't know where to start, really. Um, there's plenty of other videos out there and on their way about this. So if you want it better explained about the big meat, then go find one of those because I'm just not very good at explaining these things. So I am, however, going to do two videos that are related to the big meet. This one, obviously, has just got a brief explanation about what it was and what happened, and also the famous goodie bag. Ooh. So if you have heard about the UKPA big meet, then you've probably heard about this incredible goodie bag. It is just ridiculous. There is so much stuff in this goodie bag, and it came within the ticket you know our 20 quid ticket and i have to say the amount of stuff that's in here with my train and hotel price i've probably broken even quite frankly there's so much and it's all donated you know from etsy sellers and other places and i just i'm poor 
it's amazing. So I'm going to go through this, and in my other video, I'm going to show you the stuff that I actually bought and paid for, you know, paid money for. Um, so yeah, let's get into this. Right, here we are. Here is the infamous, infamous? <laughs> bag. Um, and I will keep this. I'm actually thinking about framing it. I think it might look nice in my craft room with a nice black frame around it. What do you think? Anyway, um, so yeah, I'm just going to sort of open it up over here and then show you things one at a time. So, here we go. Right. Now, oh, this isn't actually something in the goodie bag. This is stuff from the Kiki K Happiness mini workshop that we had. There's some bits in here. Um like a gratitude thing what makes you happy this is a nice bit here understanding where you are now and things that you can fill in which I'm gonna put in my planner and give a go and then there's the reverse bucket list which is instead of writing down things that you uh, want to do before you die you write about things that you've already achieved which I think is a genius idea um, if you didn't know, we had a talk from Christina Carlson, who's the founder of Kiki K, and then a workshop from, I've forgotten her name, how bad is that? Someone else from Kiki K, sorry. Um, so, first thing I've pulled out is this awesome pencil, which I love because um, it matches my planner perfectly. It just says on there, oh so clever, and that is from busybee.co.uk. We have this which is amazing. I'm going to open it up for you now. I should mention, I have been through the bag, but things that are in packages like this, I haven't opened. So there's going to be some stuff that I haven't actually even seen myself because I thought I'd wait and do it on video. So we have this lovely clear doki book, which has these beautiful rose gold rings. I don't I have an on it. There's the D on there. Um, I haven't quite decided what I'm going to use it for yet. I'm just in love with those rings. How pretty. But that's lovely. A little package from Sticker Bee UK, who I have done a video on before, if you want to go check that out from other things that she does. There is um, a little discount code you can use, although I'd prefer if you use mine, which is GraceB15, I believe. Um, so there's a card from Sticker B UK and then a pack of stickers here, which I shall open now. I love that washi tape. Look at that. So cute. So there are two sheets of stickers here. They're sort of just like, they're both sort of sampler sheets. Um, boxes these boxes with the um i can't think of the name sorry i'm really tired from the weekend and my brain is just not functioning correctly so lots of little cute things on there i bet you know what i best not go into too much detail about all the sticker packs because otherwise we're going to be here for hours so i'm just going to actually show you what's on, on them because as i said otherwise we will be here forever um i do however want to put things back in their packages <laughs> next is something from managing mischief co which is one of my new favorite shops um i have used their mermaid kit before which was one of my favoritest kits ever and their ice cream kit and i bought another kit from them at the big meet which i will show you in my haul video i can't get in here i need to make a pile of wrapping somewhere put that over there so a little packet of sweeties there's their card there and a sampler sheet like that then there is this from the reset girl so there's a post lovely postcard there's actually some info on the back this must come when you order from the reset girl which i haven't actually done before but it says don't worry you got this and there are some flag stickers there then there is a sticker sheet from Mrs. Brimble's, the bunny one, which I have had before from one of the boxes, but is my one of these is now empty, so I will be using this. I'm very happy to see those again. There is this pack from Crafty Alley, which just looks amazing. I haven't opened it yet, as I said before. Let's get in here. Whoop! Ah! <laughs> there's all sorts of bits in here. So there's a lovely bit of 
um, I don't know if you can see it, but it's that sort of iridescent card there. Bits of ephemera, there's a lovely flower. I think I've opened this the wrong way. There's a little black card. Let's turn this over and see all the bits and bobs down there. Look at that cute little rabbit. There's some of this. All sorts of stuff down here. These are, oh, it's a little shirt. Look, oh. Some more card, some stickers, and some papers there. Next is this lovely planner charm from uh, Fluffy Charms UK. One of these, is it needle felted, I think is the thing? I'm not going to get it out of the packet because you can see it, I think, well enough. Um, it's quite a long charm, as you can see down there. But it's got a little crown on it as well. Love that. Um, I won't get into this, but there is a discount code for uh, Filofax. Um, and there's like a catalogue of current um, stock in there. I think that's what it is anyway. Uh, is this which I'm going to open up now I'm not entirely sure where this is from but we will find out so it is from uh, the Lizu papers I'm sorry I don't have my glasses on there you go there and it is a little monthly view mini planner with the UKPA logo on there you go and it starts in October that's brilliant so that's what that looks like that is very cute and there's a little glittery tag and some very cute stickers from Miss Sparkle Plans I have a lovely postcard from a uh, snail mail love shop yeah snail mail love shop on it Etsy, I love that. Probably make that into a dashboard. And then there are so many stickers in here, it's just insane. Um, so from I think that's just one sheet, yeah, from the library designs there. Some from Stickle Co. This is um some that were sort of handed to us because apparently some were like messed up or something. I'm not sure. Uh, this was thrust at me on my way out. There's like a pictures of the admin team and stuff stickers i think were designed by handcrafted by Cherie, who is one of the admin um so there's those there is a card for uh pen gems there there's um what's this shop that how do you say that sue store maybe that's so cute i love those those are really pretty and then some stickers from Oodama Doodles. I love Oodama Doodles shop. It is beautiful. And that's this is a repositional fall in love kit. Um, and some autumn leafy things there. And there's something behind there. I think there's some little um, fireworks, possibly. Oh, yes. Glass of vinyl sparkling f fireworks in there. There is this lovely, lovely notebook by Lime Life Planners. It's super quality paper, I love it. Little card discount code from Pirongs. There is a little charm from the Lollipop Box Club and it's a little ice cream, how sweet. A little thing of memo paper, some sticky notes, the speech bubble. There is this lovely little brooch um, I don't think it's a paper clip, I'm pretty sure it's a brooch from uh, Love from Poppy. Oh look, here's my uh, name card or lanyard thing from the big meat. Yay! Definitely keeping that as a keepsake. There's some pens, this one, a gel ink pen and this space one here. Stickers from Urban Sweetheart. Some Halloween stickers from A Beautiful Plan. Some from Kelly Rose Cove. Some from, I'm probably going to mess this up, Alethea Puku, maybe? I'm sorry if I'm getting that wrong, but some stickers from there. Some stickers from Vintage Rose Studios. And there is like a little Pip Sticks um, sticker pack, which I will open this 
one because I have no idea what's inside. Well, I well and truly destroyed that envelope. Um, <laughs> there is, whoops, they've flown away. Stuff from Pipsticks. Glittery hearts, black hearts, oh, lovely. These ones, I think, oh, look at that. <gasps> circles there is some information about pip sticks and what are these ones down here your bunnies some glittery ones as well so next is a magnetic bookmark planner clip type thing from uh, my pretty weeks and made exclusively for the UKPA complete 2016 with planner princess on it love it this is actually one of my favourites, this little Halloween kit. It's just that sparkly skull. I love him. I'm in love with him. Now, where is that from? I can't read it without my glasses. It's from there. I'm so sorry. I'm a huge failure. It's from there. Because <laughs> it's quite faint. I can't see what it says. There are some cards in here. Again, Crafty Alley. Let's get in. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So these are made exclusively, obviously, for the big meat. Postcards here. So there's that. This one, I really love that. Crafty Alley is incredible. Her talent is, woo! That one. And that is stunning. So there's, oh, those. Some stickers from Thumbelina Print. There's two in there, so I better open them. So in here there is that. And they're all they're punched so you can put them straight into your planner, which is brilliant. And oh look at those boxes. Look at the little foxes. Oh some clear stickers from Emily's Planner. Some of the lovely illustrated ones from Michelle and Patch. Some uh, grocery bag ones from Sticker Sunshine. There is, oh, from Ellie Beth Designs on here. There is this from Cho Cho and Mimi, which I have not opened yet, so I'm going to do that now. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, look. Planner swag for you. <laughs> so, some little cards there. I'm not familiar with that one, but we'll take it out. So, that's from Planner Head, the UKPA crown paperclip. There is, what's this? Oh, look, it's a little, another little monthly plan. Look at that. That is so pretty. Lovely, that is. And some postcards here. Oh, I'm scared to take them out of their thing. Oh, I think they're the same. So there's two of those that say, hello you. Super amazing quality on those. And there is this Cho Cho Mimi little folder. Oh, there's stuff in it, oh my goodness. I didn't even know. This is insane. Some stickers in there. Stickers. 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 This is madness. It's like even more than I knew and I've already been through this bag twice. I just keep getting surprised every time. Right, what have we got here? There is a little charm here from Cloudy Cloud, which is Daisy, who's one of the admin. And just through sheer luck I got one in exactly the right colour from my planner so yay for that there is this charm like an official UKPA Big Meat 2016 from Dotty Moo look Eep. and then in here I think I better open this one up actually this is oh it doesn't say on the back where it's from one second so this is from Simple Heart I love that business card and they are some lovely little paper clips. Look, there's a book with a heart on. There's an OMG one. One that says plan. And one that says busy. Those are brilliant. 
Right, we're coming towards the end, I promise. Um, there is this that came from Lyra and Co, which is a lovely notebook or traveler's notebook insert. It says UK Planet Addicts on. And then this adorable little magnetic fox clip. Look at him, so sweet. And then we have yet another thing from Crafty Alley. I should say as well, Crafty Alley had bought a load of um, inserts and things with her and a load of her um, journal cards as well and was just sort of thrusting them at people. I was standing nearby to her table and she just went, here, have these. Oof. I'm like, oh, thank you. And gave me a big year insert thing for my planner, which I can't show you because my planner is in a different room. I'll do it, show you in the next video that stuff. I've also realised there was another thing that came that was on our tables, which is a personalised paper clip, which um, is in the planner, which is it's just in the other room as well. So I'm going to show you that in the next video. Um, so here's some more stuff from Crafty Alley. There's this lovely journal card and then just a selection of inserts, pocket, personal and A5, just to, to make sure everyone's got something. Isn't that sweet? Oh, look, I'm almost the black one there. Can't see it, there it is. <laughs> That's what you get for using a black background. And then this is our little sort of like guidebook or what have you. Just It's mostly just um, info about the contributors um, and the stalls that were there and things. There is at the front, there's a rundown of what we did in the day. So if you want to pause that, you can have a little look and there's some info there as well if you want to pause and have a read of that then there is this notebook um this lovely marble notebook from oh dear and um my mum's got her eye on this one so i think i'm gonna end up losing it but it's very very lovely and then here is a dashboard and inserts um set from Organised with Katie. Now I didn't actually get one of these in my goodie bag. Um, obviously the, the guys had to fill up over a hundred goodie bags and you know a couple of things slipped the net. So um, this was actually in Paula's goodie bag and she said I could have hers which was super super sweet of her but she is one of the sweetest people on the planet so and there's also some gold clips in there. So in here there's the dashboard with a quote on it and all these goal setting inserts which are printed on the nicest paper I have to say. Ooh, it's really smooth and really thick and sturdy. So all about like goal setting things for 2017 which is super super lovely. Then we have a little greetings card which is from Love Candy Designs. Look at that, very cute. A dashboard from Clarabelle Makes, or Clarabelle Makes, I'm not sure. Sorry, 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 sorry. Um, planner Addict dashboard with flamingos on will match my plan up very, very well, that one. And I think, I think that's pretty much it, apart from, oh no, a couple of little bits. Some sweets, um, a little hair clip crown that a lot of us on the day put in our hair. There, and a washi of course because there had to be a washi tape so there we go that was the contents of the big meat goodie bag i have no idea how long this video has been i'm super sorry that it has been so so long but there was just so much in this goodie bag it was incredible um wow again a massive thank you to the organizers because what a perfect day you guys did the most incredible job and yeah wow as I said, there's other videos that are going to be out there because there was like a prize session and the talk from Christina Carlson and, you know, all sorts of things. So there'll be better videos out there as to the contents of the day. I'm just, it's like what, like doing a haul video, really. Goodie bag video. So there, that is what was in the goodie bag. Eep! Um, as I said, I'm going to do another video of the haul that I got, like stuff that I actually bought. Um, both on the trip to Birmingham itself and on the day so look out for that hope I'm going to film it straight away but I've got to do all the editing and uploading so could be today could be tomorrow who knows so look out for that um as ever thank you so much for watching yet another massive thank you 
to the organisers and to the lovely people that I met, you know how who you are. So yeah, see you soon guys, bye. Mm -hmm.